Boys are boys from the beginning. If you were born a boy, you stay a boy. Girls are girls right from the start. When you're born a girl baby, you grow up to be a bigger girl and then a woman. Everybody's fancy, everybody's fine. Your body's fancy, and so is mine. Only girls can grow up to be the mummies. Only boys can grow up to be the daddies. Everybody's fancy, everybody's fine. Your body's fancy, and so... Welcome to Pure Blood Wolf Brothers. I'm Steve. And I'm Bobby. And I don't know why we're talking this slow. <laughs> I think it's because we just dawned on the real fact of why this new generation of adults has lost their flipping minds. They didn't have Mr. Rogers to inform them of the basic things in life he's a wise man he just spit some knowledge on everybody it's a shame yep We're so anyway control. bobby why don't you tell the people at home what they need to do they should like comment subscribe and share all down below g willikers isn't that special <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, get right into special what we're like be discussing uh, Madonna. Yeah, Madonna. Oh man, what's going on with her? No clue. After <laughs> plastic surgeries, things just aren't exactly that well. <laughs> you know who she looks like? Janice. <laughs> man, look, look, at the, look at the comparison. Look at that. Is maybe she went to her plastic surgeon and she was like, I want to look like this. She might have. <laughs> I mean, if you uh show the show the uh picture of what she used to look like. I mean, big difference. Well, yeah. Now she just looks like she when I look at her, it I all I see is predator versus alien. You know, okay, this is, I, I can see maybe somebody wanted to do a little touch-up here or there. Yeah, but, but not full-blown. These fantasy. celebrities that are getting all of these plastic surgeries over and over and over again, they're all looking the same. Yep. They're, it, it, it's, well, oh, man. no, not her. I don't, I've never seen anybody look like her. Um, she's, she's unique. Yeah, there no, there's there's a couple. Uh I mean I'm I'm talking heavy plastic surgery. Yeah. Um All right, and uh, on a different note, uh another Milwaukee police officer has been killed um in a right after a car chase it happened. Uh the suspect was 19 years old. He was chasing uh, both of them lost their lives. Um, it, it's it just brings you back to Milwaukee over and over again. They let violent suspects out either on bond or uh, on bail. Democratic and run city. Yeah, yeah. You lose another police officer to something like this, and uh, that was three people. We got in 2021. You had the. Or um, the braid at the end of at the end of last year, it was um, a guy who shot up a house with eight times. That was oh, just out, yes. just out on bond. And now you got this. We guy. already covered that one, though. Yep. Yeah, but I'm just bringing up the fact that Milwaukee has to be tougher on their criminals. You know, well, it's it's them... it's not just Milwaukee though. It's I mean, any Democrat-run city. Yeah, they have. It's well, look at. Now, now, this officer got killed a couple days ago already, right? Mm-hmm. And 
Wasn't it just today that Evers finally lowered uh, the flag? Evers is a little. <laughs> he's a. <laughs> oh my god! I, usually, I still, I still question how he's in office. Usually, it I happens do. the same day. A uh, police officer dies. The flags are lowered to half mast. It took him. What has it been? Three days. It's been. This is the third day, and then he sent out an order for all the flags to be lowered. It took him three days to do that. Mm -hmm. And uh, my guess is Democrat governor wants to be sure it's not racism before anything happens. When it was completely clear that what happened. Right. Oh, he irritates me. <laughs> oh, yeah, That's... let's get let's get off this subject. I'm, I'm tired of talking about Democratic about... politicians that just don't get things done or mm -hmm. are very slow to get things done. Yeah. Um, on a different note, seeing as how it's February, it's Black History Month, correct? Yep. And what's for lunch, Steve? <laughs> Man, this is this is ridiculous. Um uh, here. <laughs> this yeah, it's it's the, I'm, not, this, I'm not laughing. Be, I mean, I'm laughing that somebody actually was stupid enough to do this. Right. Um, in Grand Rapids, Grand Rapids, Michigan, yeah. they served a lunch that consisted of fried chicken, collard greens, mac and cheese, cornbread, banana pudding, Are you kidding me? <laughs> and this, you know, the sad thing is, this isn't even the first time it happened. No. Okay? It also happened in uh, 2018, University of New York. Yeah, New York. And then there was another, there was something else that happened in, um, somewhere else in New York, where they got served chicken and waffles and uh, watermelon on... February 1st. I, I'm going to point this out, okay? These are also Democratic states and cities that are doing this. Yeah, well, and it's also the it's also the food service. Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong, okay? That'd be a great lunch. That does sound good. Like, but it really it's just good. not... <laughs> to serve it... I don't know, but you know what? Maybe... Maybe they've served that exact lunch before in their defense. We don't know. We and don't. Somebody could but have just got it, offended. It, it is definitely it. kind of eyebrow raising. Yeah. Yeah. That. I mean, <laughs> it's it's Michigan. If it was like Louisiana or something, that's more of like a down south lunch right there. But mm -hmm. it seems a little odd, but it also seems delicious. <laughs> <laughs> I'd I'd go there for lunch. All right. Here's here's a, another little quick topic here. Uh, Leonardo DiCaprio, right? He is, he's, <laughs> I think he's approaching 50 years old, right? Man. He's dating a, what, 18, 19 year old model. Yeah, I heard she was 18. Okay. He has a history of dating young women, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. The guy is a famous celebrity, loaded with money. Okay, sorry. Guys generally view younger women as beautiful, blah, 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 whatever. No drama, blah, 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 whatever. Okay. She might be looking at him as a couple things. Either that's it, her ticket to, like, let's say they were to stay together and he wouldn't drop her like everybody else he has. No, nah, she's um, just got daddy issues. <laughs> she could. She could. <laughs> But I mean, what is she? She's looking to be financially set. If if she's doing this outside of her, you know, whatever. I don't. I don't care who anybody dates, as long as you're consenting adults. Who really cares? You know. True, but it's it's such a. I mean, <laughs> I got into an argument with with a couple ladies about this, and they cringed at it. Okay, I'm I'm not saying that it's exactly the best thing to do because DiCaprio and this this model are mentally probably in two different spectrums yeah or ends of the spectrum 
but come on, man. They, they, well, let's be real. They only spend time together between the hours of like 11 p.m. and like 6 a.m. <laughs> you know, probably. Yeah, their maturity level, I'm sure, is on a completely different scale. Right. And I don't know if I was him, I, I couldn't stand dating an 18 year old. Yeah. Yeah. There's. Nah. I mean. Yeah. My bets. Um, my bets still daddy issues though. It could be. It's. Could I, be. I just. I. I just don't think it's something out of the norm for celebrities, especially to be doing no. it. No, they got money. Yeah, that's that is normal. Whatever. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the show. You guys have a good night, and don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment down below. Joe Biden.